What is up, bitches? It's Booty. And that's right, it's Doom Eternal time. Let me crack open this monster. My epic gamer fuel. Oh yeah, I hope you got that nice and hot on the mic. Mmm. I've been waiting all fucking day to play this. Um. Granted, I've been home for a while now. Okay, I hope I don't actually have to go and do this, I swear to god. Do I? This will link your account for... Okay, where's the I don't care button? Oh my god. Re. Well, it better be instant. Oh, okay, I love the tunes right now. I'm loving this. But yeah, I've been waiting all day to play this. It's... I had to get up pretty early at work, as per usual. The good old-fashioned 7 in the morning shift. Even though we get our work done so early that it kind of defeats the purpose. And, uh, I don't know if I'll do it on camera, but I'm definitely gonna try the multiplayer when I have the chance. I gotta activate the PSN tomorrow, cause I, uh, for some reason, I use like a, a special card from work. It's not from any particular bank. But, basically PSN won't detect it because it doesn't come with its own card holder name. Just dumb as shit. Okay, I'll keep that on, cause there might be something new there. Um, let's see, any subtitles? Where are the subtitles? Here? Good. Ooh, they're on by default. Now that is good game design. And I guess we'll keep it on regular for the time being. I don't know how small or big it is. Alright, let's kick some ass. And I'm probably gonna avoid talking too much during the cutscene. Ultraviolet, like a man. I always play Doom on Ultraviolet. It's like the equivalent of, um, Heroic in Halo. It feels like the game is really designed for it, you know? You're doing yourself a huge disservice if you're not playing on Ultraviolet. And I did bring the mic a little bit closer, so that's why I'm slightly louder. Against all the evil... Hell on Earth. Ooh, it's just like Doom 2. All the wickedness that mankind can produce, we will send unto them. Only you. Rip and tear until it is done. His voice sounds pretty different from a 2016, from what I recall. It's interesting that it opens up with the same icon as a uh, 2016. Wow. Okay, they left a mark on the earth. That is literally a fucking... That is so corny. I love it. I hope we get to see a lot of uh, just normal human interaction. More world building. And from what I can understand, it sounds like this game is going to focus more on the story. At least more than the last game. That's a good title right there. So is this supposed to be like playing on a radio that Doom guys got? Oh wow, you actually see his face, holy shit. <laughs> How hard will Booty fanboy 
Let's see. Okay, we're just right into it, and wow, the shotgun looks, uh, weird. It looks different. Okay, so, like, right off the bat, we're not able to, like, right stick. We can't just melee these, uh, zombies. Exactly. They're significantly tougher. Dude, look at how many melees it's taken. Jesus Christ. And I guess it does prevent, like, uh, glory kill cheese. Unless these enemies are, like, designed for it. Wow. Way to go, booty. Ooh, you actually get, like, a... Was that an animation just because there's nothing on there? Man, it feels so weird to be playing with, um, a controller again on a shooter. Yeah, I know. Now, let's see, um... Yeah, it looks like they're just in general super tanky now. That's weird. Ugh. But now the zombies are actually threatening, and they were not threatening at all in the first game. Oh, I thought I saw something glowing there. Did I just go in a circle? What is that? Okay, how do I crouch? Okay, right... Oh yeah, this is for the weapon wheel. Yeah, I'm messing with the D-pad. I'm just messing around with the buttons. Oh, oh, okay. I got flipped turned upside down. <laughs> I feel dumb. <laughs> Where are we anyway? It's not super clear. Are we on Earth already? And I believe square. Oh, what the fuck? Circle the dismiss. Oh. So you don't have to switch to it now. It's not an individual weapon. That's actually really good. Although, I don't know if we necessarily needed a, uh... Tutorial sequence like this. Like, just completely pull us out of the level. That's kind of weird. <laughs> Definitely something the, uh... The first game didn't do just to teach you the, uh, base mechanics. What's this? Oh, okay, they're punchable. Press X to jump into the air to perform the double- Oh, we actually start with it. That's great. And it actually is bothering me, the font size. So let's just make it large, because it's actually kind of hard for me to read it. And hopefully that's better, and I- That's definitely an explosive barrel. Oh, right here? There we go. I love- These are super glowy, man. The weapon mod screen, interact with a mod bot, to, yeah. Now, sticky bombs. A grenade launcher that fires up to five sticky bombs. Wait, let's see that in action. Okay. Full auto. That sounds better. Let's, uh, get this. And you gotta hold it down. Okay, I'll get it. Beat the shit out of it! To activate a weapon mod... Press or hold L2, then R2 to fire. Oh, boo, you didn't punch it. Ooh. Wait, how much... So, how do you tell how much ammo you have in the chainsaw? That's my question. Okay, 4 out of 30? Ooh, I love that. Wait, look at these physics. Let me see, maybe the wheel tells us? No? What if you hold it down? Okay. Because I don't know if you can get it to, like, show up regularly to, like, check the ammo on the chainsaw, but let's just keep moving. It sounds like we're just in the middle of a battlefield with all the random explosions and shit. Aw, oh, man. I hope I didn't make a mistake playing this on, uh, <laughs> Ultra Violence immediately. 
But hey, we are getting some health, so maybe it won't be that bad. Ooh, they actually make the, uh, the machine gun guys look different now. The only thing is, like, if you're low on ammo, you can't, like, just melee your problems to death, you know? I guess that's what this is for. Oh, okay, that's how you would do that, I see. That guy almost looks like Doom Guy. Alright. Come on, you motherfucker. And th it actually looks like they added more detail to the imps, which is awesome. Unless there's gonna be, like, other variants of the imps that look like the ones from, uh, 2016. Then jump away! I don't wanna get hit. Ooh, nice tracking, buddy. And how much? Okay, it looks like we got nothing. Okay, we have one in there. So I guess we can do that. Ah, oh, it feels so good knowing it's instant now. I'm not sure about the range of the shotgun. I'll have to, like, keep experimenting, experimenting with it. Excuse me. Okay, okay, before we go in there, because we're pretty low on ammo, let's just keep looking around. And I haven't really been using the explosive barrels, huh? And I guess these are just the health, yeah. I, if it's the color blue, booty, it's definitely the health. Well, I guess they at least, the fact they glow so hard makes it hard to miss them, at least, even though it's uh, a little cartoonish. That is some metal shit. I don't even know what this is. Like, what are the demons doing? I hope we get to see, like, more Doom 3 kind of imagery where, like, the walls are alive. I love that shit. A hell barge? Oh, that's just a lore thing. Eh, should I read it? Okay, atop the mighty thralls, the hell priests oversaw the invasion of the mortal world the thrall slave titan of the underworld carried the priest temples into the wake of battle i'm not reading the hell thing okay i left school to get the fuck away from reading <gasps> oh my god <laughs> Get fucked, bro. Wear his crown. But I didn't expect to run into, like, an enemy that would just straight up talk to us, because that's never... That definitely never happened before. At least from what I played in Doom 2016. Okay, so I guess we're just starting in hell. Wait, no, this... Oh my fucking god. This is Earth for sure. <laughs> there are two hell priests remaining. That is just a giant like it's not quite a cyber demon. The cyber demon wishes it was that fucking guy. What How do I even lose to hell? I mean how do I beat hell? Hell can just spawn like a million of those guys, right? It's so weird to like see vehicles and shit in this game. Used to being on Mars. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna save that until we find a different weapon, like just in case. Can I get up here? Nope. Well, not from that way, of course. I wonder if we'll run into, like, human survivors or if everything will just be super fucked. Objective marker... Yeah, no shit. Oh. Oh. Okay. So is it just gonna throw Kaga demons and everything at us immediately? Ooh. 
The UI really makes me think of Quake, not gonna lie. Okay, there's some good, uh, range on this thing. And everything is so much more emotive, too. So I guess 16 is the max. That kind of sucks, dick. That is, like, unbelievably bad for a shotgun, man. Okay. Let's see how the fall damage is. Wow, he didn't even react to it. Whoa, you didn't die yet? <laughs> oh, I guess that was infighting. I do love how they get to retain, like, some of these, uh, animations. Let me double check the melee, see? Yeah, just not that amazing in this game. So, yeah, the glory kills... I guess... Melee is not something you want to use too much in this game. It's more about uh, landing the shooting, which is good. Because you could argue that it was um, overpowered in the first game. Oh, yes! Ooh! Ooh! Weak point. Oh, they got weak points now? They have weak points that can be shot for extra damage. Is heavy range cannon. The turret is a weak point. Oh. Okay, I thought they were gonna have one, like, right here. Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh, dude, it's breaking apart. That is so awesome. Dude, the... This motherfucker's badass, Jesus. Please give me health. Okay, you can give me a lot. I'm not great at aiming, guys. I'm so used to the mouse. I don't remember having this much trouble with uh, the first game. Oh, please don't die. Okay, somehow that worked out. Oi, I might have to change the sensitivity options. Okay, that is not what I wanted to get. Ooh. Oh my god. I don't know how that went so much, so much off of Mark. <laughs> Let me double check the uh, gameplay settings, because I don't know if there's like an auto aim that ain't on or what. Hmm. Aim assist? Yeah, that's on. <laughs> and it's at max strength. <laughs> Yes! That looks like the machine gun. Yeah, I don't even know if I'm going to be able to talk about this, because this game's pretty intense already. But, um... Crazy day at work, honestly. So, now at work, because everyone's afraid of the fucking coronavirus, it turns out that you have to, like, sign this paperwork every time you start your shift, where it's like, are you coughing, are you, uh, sneezing, do you have a cold or a flu? And if you answer yes at all, then it's like, you're off for, uh, like, 14 days. Which is, uh, pretty badass, not gonna lie. Because I could use some time to myself to focus on that. Wow. Holy shit. I, I hope I get to drive something like that at some point. Okay. I guess I gotta get up on that bus, right? Let's do this. Oh, wait, no. Maybe it's over here? No. That's an invisible wall. 
Okay, um, what was it? The D-pad? Okay, there we go. We gotta get that way. I see, I see. Can I get up here? Good lord, I, I fucking feel like... That, uh, I don't know if you guys have seen that demo footage from, uh, the, the game reviewer. It, it's kind of infamous now. Where he was just comically bad at the demo and he complained it was too hard. Auto map stations. Okay. Ooh, that's cute. We got a little Doom guy. Although I think I'm already doing better than him. Because I'm playing on Ultra Violence and I haven't died once. Although I kind of want to see what the death animations are like. I really don't... Arachnatrons are so much harder in this game than they are in, um... Oh! Dude, what the fuck? There we go. I don't know why I kept trying to hit him, but it just didn't work. Ah, oh, shit. It seems like a lot of this uh, encounter design, much like 2016, is going to be about, um... Spawns. Kind of like Doom 3, too. Oh my god, no! Come on. It's so hard to aim. <laughs> okay, let's see how the load times are. Alright, cool, that was like damn near instant. Alright, in the checkpoints... Eh, this is an okay checkpoint. Can you actually... No, no, it is definitely checkpoint based. You can't bullshit around with, um... You know, quick saving and whatnot. I, I just want to get the Arachnatron now. It seems like infighting is going to be more important, at least in this part. Oh my god! <laughs> Maybe I should use my uh, machine gun now that I think about it. I need more monster energy. And yeah, I guess the shotgun isn't very good at uh, long range after all. So it's not like the classic one. However, the range on the grenade seems okay. Alright, and I'm definitely gonna have to shave off one of you guys. Alright, let's see how this goes. I'll, even though I'm scared shitless to fight this enemy now. Although, if there's rocket launchers here, that'd be badass. So I guess everyone at UAC is just batshit crazy. It's not even the, the religious woman from the first game. Oh no. <laughs> I do not want to do... Okay, whatever. Thank God that didn't count. So even if you have the chainsaw equipped, it doesn't count. That's good. I am out of ammo. This is no bueno. Okay. Come on, you motherfucker. Actually, you know what I feel like more than anything as far as, like, Let's Players go? I feel like, uh, Ego Raptor in that, uh, Doom 2 video he's been doing. Where he's, like, playing Doom 2 with the fucking PS4 version, I think, with a controller. Instead of playing with a mouse and keyboard, and you can just tell his accuracy is really bad. Remember, kids, it's never your fault if you're using a controller. Even though there are people that get amazing with controllers.
Ah, oh, shit. Oh, thank god. Get to the Citadel. Okay, and I'm, I'm gonna save that. Can I get in here? <gasps> Dude, what the f- One up? What do you mean, one up? There are lives in this game? Unless it's like... I, I haven't seen a lot of, uh... I haven't really seen any demo footage other than, uh, from that game reviewer. So I don't know much about, like, the new mechanics of this game. Okay, yellow. How convenient that it says that. Oh, wow, you get to blow holes in them. Alright, let's throw down, bruh. Can I get in here? No. I still haven't figured out, can you not crouch in this game? Come to think of it, could you even crouch in the first game? It feels weird to not be able to crouch in a first person shooter. How am I gonna do sick ass slides, man? Oh wow, this motherfucker's looting his shots. hell is that? It is nice that you're, ge you're getting to use the chainsaw a lot more often. Alright, so you can attach my walls by pressing R3. Okay. Let's try this. Okay. Interesting. Ooh, that's a sick ass yellow key guy. Oh no. I hope none of these guys have rocket launchers, I swear to god. I don't know if they're they might be that evil. Because so far this game is actually really difficult. Especially compared to uh, the first game. Or I'm just not used to it, who knows? Oh god. Wait, wait, really? That's bullshit. Oh, we got straight up turrets. Wow. Uh. Okay. Just more reason for me to get a good computer, man. But yeah, so like I actually, in, in regards to the whole work thing, I was actually coughing uh, at work today. I'm pretty sure I don't have corona, but you know, people be scared. And uh, actually the manager figured it would just be allergies because it was kind of just random. And it wasn't exactly like violent hacking so can you destroy these i don't think so i thought uac was all about just getting resources why are they all like a bunch of cult freaks and retards now oh okay please take that all right that that's good that it gives you that uh oh god Uh, die! Oh, uh, what happened? I mean, I guess I got killed by the fireball, right? I thought you'd be like invulnerable during the glory kills, so that's why it confuses me a bit. Alright, give me it. Did I get it? No, I didn't. Dude, this thing is like so accurate too. Okay, there we go. Alright. 
how am I gonna do this? Can I jump over that? Yes, I can. Okay, okay. Anything over there? No, that's just a wall. <laughs> yes! This is what I'm talking about. This is what I like to see. Although it's not as grotesque and creepy as in Doom 3. Okay, we've been going for like... 34 minutes, it looks like. Yeah, 34 minutes. You see, uh, the PS4 recorder stops around an hour. So I'm, I'm trying to keep an eye on that. Okay, now considering that my biggest problem is my aiming, I think I'm gonna get this. Well, I don't know, it may- <laughs> I might have actually fucked myself, it might be better to get the micro missiles, cause... I doubt that has significant auto-aim either. And that's weird that they, instead of just tossing them like normal, you have like this predator style plasma cannon thing on your shoulder. So what happens if you hold down L1? Oh. Okay, it just fires instantly no matter what. Got it. So I guess you can't really like hold it and then bounce it off walls exactly. 